Hello guys and welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you how to get a 2G phone working on T-Mobile's 2G network in 2023. Okay so before we start the video there's two main disclaimers I want to go over. So number one, this isn't actually a permanent fix. This is not actually registering these phones on the network. What it's doing is tricking the network into thinking that these phones are a more modern phone that has 4G or 5G capabilities. And so what that means is that they can kind of break at any moment. It just will disconnect from the network at a random point. Generally, this is when you've gone long distances to um, other towers, maybe in another county, or after a certain time, maybe weeks or months, but it's pretty random. It's hard to tell. So if you do this method, expect the phone to only work for a certain period of time. All right, so number two, you need a very specific SIM card and network carrier for this to work. So if you're in the US like me, you need T-Mobile, AT&T and Verizon won't work. Um, you can also use one of T-Mobile's network virtual operators. In this case, I'm using Mint Mobile. And actually speaking on that, um, if you're planning on getting started with that now, um, those are the only ones you can use because uh, T-Mobile in, um, I think it was 2017, came out with a new SIM card design for their phones, which looks like this. And so if you have a T-Mobile card like this, then it won't work in those phones. But if you have a T-Mobile card from before 2017, or if your card looks like this, as you can see, there's two separate patterns here. So you want to make sure that your card has this one, otherwise it won't work in the phone. If you put this one in, it's just going to say invalid SIM card or something like that. So make sure your SIM card is like this and it is a T-Mobile SIM card or one of their virtual operators or whatever. So that's like Mint Mobile, Red Pocket, um, but at and and Verizon will not work. So with that being said, let's get into how to do this. Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do is get yourself a modern phone and then put the SIM card in the phone. As you can see, this is currently getting 5G. So after that, what you want to do is go into your settings. You want to go to connections, and then you want to go to mobile networks. And then in this menu, you want to change that network mode to 2G only. And then you're get, it's gonna look like you don't have any signal there. But then what you want to do is open up the call app and then call voicemail. And it should go through to voicemail. If it doesn't, you then give it a few tries. And after that, you can exit right out of voicemail after it connects. And if you've done that all right, you, what you should have here is this little E, which means edge, and is 2G. And so then after that, what you're able to do is just swap that SIM into the flip phone and it will work. Then get your phone, take it apart and um, make sure the uh, SIM card that you get should come with a few different sizes. Make sure that you're using the largest of the size, and so I'm just gonna stick that right in the center there. Now once you have it all stuck in there, like so, you just insert it into the phone, and uh, they can kind of have different insertion methods, but generally it's in the back here, underneath the battery. And then you want to get your battery and uh, just slide it back on and then put the bottom on your phone and then power it up and you should see in a second here this powers on um, after it goes ahead and loads and everything here you should see now it's going to search for the network for a minute and then as you can see T-Mobile, it's not actually T-Mobile, it's Mint, but this phone is stupid. And um, you're gonna have Signal, and C, now we have Edge, which is the maximum this phone supports, which is just between 2G and 3G. Okay, so just to show you that this is fully working, I'm going to go ahead and call that phone right there. So just to do that, uh, do this, and then in a second here, you sh will see it is fully working. If I go ahead and answer. Hello. Hello. As you can, As hear, you can hear, it is it working, is working fully. fully. 
And, and yeah, that's yeah, about, that's about it. it. So yeah, works fine. And then also, messages work too. So, if I want to, you know, send a brief. Hello. And then send that. As you can see, it works. And you can also receive calls, receive text, you know, everything else works. If enough people want, I can make a video on setting up MMS so you can send photos and receive photos. But yeah, that's how to get your phone working with uh, T-Mobile's 2G network here in the US.